Hey everybody, welcome back to the shop. Ten more minutes. Thunder Chief building action. Ah. Okay, I got all my pieces glued on. And I figured before I started priming this, it was going to need filled anyway. You know, so I just, I just filled that whole thing. <laughs> Except what was already smooth. Now, my first coat of primer, I'll get to sand it. It'll be good to go. And when I get it, once I get it sanded, I'll drill me a hole in here and put me a stick in there. So, because all this will have to be one layup and around. And we'll show you how to do that. We'll whoop us up a couple of ducks. Brand new sheet of 220. Lots of water. Lots of water. I tell you what, putting that four ounce over the top of it really helped. It's was uh, wasn't too bad, you know. I'm gonna start doing that to that foam when I'm making my gloves. Finish it off with a layer of 400, and uh, I mean uh, 400, four ounce. This come out pretty smooth. Instead of spraying a coat of primer on it first, man, that's just wasting a coat of primer. That primer is expensive. You know, I used three dollars worth of filler. You know, that filler's cheap. And um, instead of priming it, you know. And then staining it all back Plus, we ain't got to do some sanding in a long time. You guys realize that? It's been a long time since we did some sanding. See, that's pretty smooth now, man. I'll hit that with a coat of primer and that'll look good. You know, if you go to our website, number 355, video number 355, well, Barack Obama gave us some pictures of the inside of this ductwork. <laughs> now, is that really Barack Obama? <laughs> That's what I want to know. But it showed the panel lines and everything inside the ducts. And uh, yeah, I'm thinking about doing that. I think that'd be cool. And then when I lay my ducts up, I'll spray the, instead of primer, I'll spray my white paint. Because there ain't no way you're going to get inside there and paint all this white afterwards. So I'll pre-paint these ducts. And uh, when I pull them out to mold, they'll look good, man. Gotta do instead of spraying some primer, spray white paint. Well, 
We actually want this edge slightly rounded. We don't want a sharp corner on there. So that glass can go around that corner a little better. Violet don't even do that. Panel lines on the inside of his ducts. <laughs> They'll be viewable too. You'll be able to see them plain as day. So I think I'll go ahead and do it. I ain't but a couple in there. Well, when you're at this stage right here, that fiberglass dulls this paper really fast. So sandpaper's cheap too. You know, new sheet, what's, what's the new one? It's going to cost you about seven cents. You know, for the square. So don't mess with the sandpaper. Gets dull, get it out of there. Put on a new piece. And by this little cut out here, Man, that makes me able to move my gas tanks way back just from that little bitty cutout I made. And uh, they'll be way back on the CG now instead of in front of it. Just got to think ahead, you know, and all this stuff. You got your fuel too far forward, then you got CG changes. You know, especially your main tank. You know, because you're carrying a gallon of fuel, you know. You get that main tank too far forward, and then you got, you know, you just got to retrim halfway through the flight. It'll start climbing because the nose is getting lighter. Around this corner here. 